Hey, CCBT family. We are so thankful for those of you who are able to join us at Banquet on Sunday night. And if you joined us, uh, you heard that this week is the week of giving for CCBT. And so every day we're going to be posting a video of a student sharing the impact of CCBT on their life. And so whether you joined us for Banquet or not, we would love for you to just jump in and watch these videos every day at three o'clock. We're going to be premiering a new video on our social media and our YouTube page. And so we want you to share this with others, share this with family, friends, your church, and just a, another video of the impact of CCBT each day for the next week. We're very excited about it. And when each video is posted, there's going to be ways that you could give and support the mission of CCBT. And so we're very thankful for you. Thank you to those who have already given. And um, like we said at the banquet, we're going to send a t-shirt and a sticker um, to those who give. And so we're very thankful for you and excited for you to see these videos each day. Check Hi, CCVT fam. I'm Victoria Paselli. I'm a junior at Radford University and I'm studying recreational therapy. Um, when I was asked to make a video about the impact retreats had on me that I've been to with CCVT, I started thinking, how did I even get involved with CCVT? Because I'm at Radford, I'm not at Tech, so it made me think back. And I realized that um, it was at a retreat that I first really got involved and really got to know people. So that was cool. Uh, my brother was a an intern with CSF, and um, he said, come to this retreat, I want to see you there. And I said, I don't have money. <laughs> but he got me in contact with Mike Stoller, and he, Mike said not to worry about it. He said, I want you there, we want you there, um, we want you to come anyway. So I did. I hopped in the Belmont van and packed my stuff up in there and went on a weekend retreat with CVT. Um, I really got to know people very well. That's what happens when you're stuck in a van for three hours and bunk together for two days. Um, and what I really got out of the retreats was how welcome I felt, um, that the people there really cared about me, my walk with Christ, and really wanted me to be there. Um, it also helped me to feel like I wasn't alone. Um, at Radford, as a Christian woman, I felt pretty alone a lot of times um, in my walk with Christ. And when I went on these retreats, and I looked forward to them every time, I knew I wasn't alone. I knew that people were there, that there are people there willing to pray with me that I could worship next to and hear Jesus' truth with um, to know that I really am not alone in this. So I'm very thankful for CCBT for providing these um, wonderful experiences for us. They're fun. They're so uplifting. And I honestly, I don't know that kind of Christian love and fellowship anywhere else besides CCBT retreats. <laughs> Thanks, y'all.